Happy New Year, everyone. Happy 2018. It is currently Thursday, January 4th, as I'm filming this. So, um, yeah, it's the new year and it's crazy. Every January I do a video kind of just reflecting the past year and instead of just talking about like things that I liked and that like, you know, 2017 essentials, blah blah blah, I wanted to do something like a little bit more personal and just kind of like a cooler video. I've seen these before and they're basically 100 things that I did in this year, so that's what I'm doing today. These are, for the most part, in order. I tried to put them in order as best I could, but some of them like maybe just like, I don't know, a few days you know, it's like switched. Today I'm going to be telling you guys 100 things that I did in 2017 and I'm gonna put like pictures in it and all that so it's gonna be like kind of cool so yeah. I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started. I celebrated the beginning of 2017 with my friends. I volunteered at a movie theater. I went to my first tournament as a coach. I was awarded a tennis scholarship and invited to a ceremony. I turned 18 years old. I participated in the polar bear plunge. I signed to play D2 tennis for Wilmington University. I visited my friends in the US Virgin Islands. I drove a boat to the British Virgin Islands. I went snorkeling in the British Virgin Islands. I laid on a hammock and relaxed in the British Virgin Islands. I went scuba diving in the US Virgin Islands. I enjoyed many alcoholic drinks in the US Virgin Islands. I was 18 and 18 is a legal age there, so uh, it's legal. <laughs> I made a new friend in the Virgin Islands. <laughs> I helped build a ramp for my high school tennis team. I played first singles for my last and senior year, obviously, of tennis for high school. I coached two tournaments in one weekend, one of which wasn't even my team. <laughs> the team that wasn't my team that I coached got, uh, oh wait, whoa, first place in silver and we celebrated with a team dinner at Buffalo Wild Wings. I won my high school's first ever badminton tournament. I figured out a way to use giant paper clips to organize my hats. <laughs> I went to Las Vegas and I saw the best cactus ever. <laughs> I took a picture with a giant duck. <laughs> I visited the Hoover Dam in Nevada slash Arizona. I saw beautiful mountains just outside of like the actual Las Vegas, like the strip. I took four AP tests and only passed two of them. I volunteered at a bunny shelter. I hosted the end of season bonfire slash, um, what am I saying, banquet for my volleyball team. I hosted the end of season tennis banquet. I went to senior prom with my friends and I went to senior after prom with my friends. I didn't get back until like 4 in the morning and then I woke up the next day to play tennis for states at 7 a.m. I skipped the day of school to go to the beach with my friends. I went to my sister's NJHS National Honor Society induction ceremony. I went to a Harry Potter themed birthday party. I made it in the yearbook. <laughs> I celebrated my last day of high school. I graduated high school. <laughs> I went to the Firefly Music Festival with my cousins. I went to a lot of grad parties. I went to my friend's going away party. She went back to Italy, it was so sad. I moved out and into my own house. I got a summer job teaching tennis lessons to kids. <laughs> I went to Ocean City, Maryland with Camila and spent a late night on the beach and an early morning. I went to a 4th of July party. I was the designated driver for my neighbors for dinner one night. I played mini golf at the beach. I visited the beautiful Perryland, or wait, no, Perryville, Maryland, <laughs> and cheered my parents on on the triathlon. I went to Dorney Park and was reunited with all of my Dorney friends. I went to a Mr. Wife's concert for free, and then I got free tickets from that concert, and then I sold them and made some money. <laughs> I had a filmed the whoa, I had a filmed themed graduation party. I babysat a lot. <laughs> I went to the movies, I rode my bike along the canal, I went to a pool party, and I rode Gary the Golden Goose. <laughs> I saw a rainbow, I got Froyo with my friends, I went to the Balloon and Wine Festival, I went to the Pennsylvania Run Fair, I went bowling with my team, I walked down the riverfront with one of my teammates, I started my first year of college at Wilmington University, I took a spontaneous trip to Philly with my team, and we attempted to see the solar eclipse. <laughs> I said goodbye to Peyton. 
I went to a sauna for the first time ever. I played beach volleyball with my friends. I went to a college party. And the next day, I went to a Labor Day party. I had lunch in Delaware City. I went for a nature walk in UD and visited my friends. I volunteered at the Mud Run. I went to a yoga class. I played in the US Open area in New York. And I spent an hour in New York City at one in the morning. I met Joe Biden. I surprised my high school volleyball team at one of their games. I saw deer in New Jersey after a tennis match. I had the best buffalo chicken sandwich I've ever had. I went to homecoming game day. I saw a really good and funny play. I went to the pumpkin patch. I went to a Halloween party. My team got second place in the CACC tournament in Connecticut. I walked for the Make-A-Wish Foundation. I played Mario Kart in Walmart. <laughs> I helped throw my mom a surprise 50th birthday party. I did the reindeer run. I went to a 90s concert with my mom. I started my second year of coaching. I finished my first semester of college. I went to New York City for the first snow of the season. I went to a Christmas party. I did Vlogmas for the first time ever. I hope it's on this side, but I'll have the, um, you know, the card up here. <laughs> I made gingerbread houses. I had a bonfire and s'mores with friends, and I counted down to 2018 and danced my way into the new year. All right, there you have it. That was 100 things that I did in, <coughs> oh my gosh. That was 100 things that I did in 2017. I hope you guys liked this video. I thought it was a little different. I was like, why not? Let me do it. I love watching these videos, so I was like, I'm gonna make one. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys had a great 2017 and I hope you guys are having a great new year Even though it's only the fourth day of the year. I still hope you're having a great year so far Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye